Greetings. This is I, the Dalek Emperor. Welcome back to the Stanley Parable for Forgotten Monkeys. Now, apparently, um, apparently there are some endings that I have actually oh, missed. What could it mean? Stanley decided, decided to go to the meeting room. room. Now, this, then, he thought to himself, this is a bucket. Yes, I know. Was. Um. I think I'll visit the new content uh, after I've done um, the endings that the ending that I uh, forgot to do. Anyway, still no one was here. Stanley needed the bucket's warmth and comfort now more than ever. Perhaps his boss's office was where he'd come into a staircase. Stanley and the bucket walked upstairs to the boss's office. Okay. Anyway, um... Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Crushed by the weight of the Stanley guessed the correct code by sheer luck. Was it the bucket knew all along? Was the but yeah, there him? appears to be an ending for which I have missed. But I didn't even know existed, but... Okay. The elevator raced downward, plummeting towards an unknown fate. It would be all Stanley could do to keep himself together, if not for the bucket. Soothing him, comforting him, reassuring that in this darkest moment of uncertainty, he would be all right. Oh, there we go. The bucket is here for you, Stanley. Everything will be fine. Yes. Stanley and the bucket walked straight ahead through the large door that read, Mind Control Facility. Yes, um... There was something here, apparently. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with whoa, television wait, screens. Wait, whoa, what horrible I didn't know I could do this. Just as Stanley was about to further into the mind control facility, he tripped and fell over the railing and into the dark void below. Oh dear. Thankfully, he fell directly onto the bucket, which safely cushioned his fall. Now, what to do next, Stanley wondered. Stanley and the bucket could find no way out of this enormous pit, um, and so eventually yes. they decided that the best thing to do would be to simply get comfortable down here. Um, okay. So they set up a little couch and relaxed. It really wasn't so bad down here, a bit cold perhaps. Oh, I, I, I didn't... After some time I didn't know by, it. They installed a few shelves as well, and a sort of kitchenette. Well, I didn't know this was its own ending. But it wasn't until the rugs and the standing lamps came in that it really started to feel like a home. What the heck? In fact, after some time, Stanley realized that it had been ages since he had even thought of the mind control facility at all. He'd never gotten to fully explore what was up there, never been able to unearth the many mysteries of the mind control facility. This lack of closure began to up the outside. Soon he was dwelling on his regrets, and the state of their home slowly decayed, as Stanley became withdrawn and neglected the clean. He unsettled the bucket deeply. Stanley wasn't usually like What the heck? The bucket tried to reach out to him again and again, but I knew all I missed some endings. All he could talk about was going back, doing it over again. Staying on the path. Um, okay. It was a mistake to leave the path. It was a mistake. It was a mistake. I need to do what the narrator says. I need to see the true ending. <laughs> this made no sense at all to the bucket. It was simply trying to live its life down here as comfortably as possible. Yet Stanley was unconsolable. Um, this isn't an ending. This is just a hole in the ground. The bucket sighed. True, it wasn't an ending. But it's where we happen to be. Yes. And maybe, possibly, if we accept the reality of things, maybe this will become an ending eventually. Okay. It's what the bucket was counting on. Tell me about it. The two of them waited for a very long time. Well, well. I think... All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? 
Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed him. Finally, yes, the bucket. Yes, yes, yes. I love that bucket. Wait, um... All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley I wonder if it does the same ending if I do the same thing, but differently. Without the buckets, then. Set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Yeah, I wonder what happens if I Yet there was not a single don't person use there the bucket. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Yes. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this, what dark secret was being held from him. What he could not have known, Stanley was in such a rush to get through the story as quickly as possible, he didn't even have a single minute to just let the narrator talk. That kind of anxiety is lovely. So he relaxed for a few moments. But yeah, we're gonna Some see what happens if I do it without the bucket this time. Come on. Feeling soothed yes. and rejuvenated, All right. Stanley calmly walked forward into the opened passageway. Straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Let's see what's changed. Um. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. What horrible secret did this place hold? Stanley thought. Aha! You've made it to the bottom of the yes, Mind Control I have. Facility. Welcome! You see, back when the Stanley Parable first launched in 2013, getting to the bottom of the mind control facility was a bug that we simply didn't catch during development. And you all sent us lots of photos of it on Twitter and acted very superior about it. Um, yes. And you're all very, very clever, good for you. Anyway, when it came time to update the game, we knew that we had to do something about this little goof of ours. So, here you go. New content. You can call it the bottom of the mind control room ending, if that enhances your perception yes, of the mind uh, uh, Isn't I guess. that what you crave? New content? Yes. Always more content, more content, more, 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 more. And I'm here to give it to you. I'm here to make it seem like we really covered every nook and cranny of the game with secrets and easter eggs. How about this? We wrote a new piece of music just for this section. Okay. You don't hear it anywhere else in the game. It's a secret that's just for you. That's how special you are. Okay. We call this track, Good Job You've Made It to the Bottom of the Mind Control Facility. Well done. Okay. Good job. You did it. What? Good job. Good job, you made it to the bottom of the mind control facility. Jumped on the catwalk, you should have been careful, what? should have been careful. Used to be a bug, but now it's an ending, now it's an ending. What? I believe in you, I believe in your ability to cross this barrier. Chase your dreams. The railings don't mean anything. Good job, you did it. 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 Okay, yes, um I guess I did. Oh. 
There you go. Um, um, oh, good vape. All of his co workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided Apparently, to the, the um, perhaps he had simply missed a one man, one bucket, one chance to seize their destiny together. Mm. Right, so, hmm. I guess we'll do this oh, then. New content? What does that mean? New well, guess, I guess we'll see what the new content. The new, 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 new content, I mean. See what's different and. See what happens when I hold the. Thank you for playing the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Me. As you may know, the Stanley Parable was a video game released in 2013 on home computers. Okay. After receiving critical and commercial success, it was expanded upon in 2022 with the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, a reimagining of the game for consoles and home computers. Yes, we've been through this already. Exciting new content that broadens and expands the world of the Stanley Parable, delighting audiences the world over. Please step inside and see what thrilling new adventures await in the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Oh well, this sounds delightful. I'm very excited to see the thrilling new Ultra Deluxe content. Yes. Wait, Stanley. I've just now realized. That bucket you're holding, it's the bucket I've been working on. The reassurance bucket. Where did you get your hands on it? Isn't this the preview to the sequel? Uh, let's just say time away? travel. This, this makes no sense at all. Or, uh, uh, I don't really know. Hold on. Did I already show you my ideas for the sequel? Um, yes. I don't doing that at all. You did. You're seeing things all out of order. Okay. Alright. The jump right, circle. The jump circle? Well, I can't seem to use that for some reason. Leaping through it hole? The giant door? Did you see them already? Stanley, none of them are ready here. I'm still developing them. They're not even close to finishing. How do they look when you saw them? Um, yes, yes they, they were. Well on the promise of everything that a sequel to Stanley Parable could possibly be. <clears throat> Had I figured out how the hell to make a sequel to this game? Uh, yes, uh, oh. Yeah, um. Wait, if you're still carrying the bucket around with you, if the bucket is interesting to you, that means I must have made it correctly. Yes. Yes. You carrying the bucket with you everywhere is exactly what I set out to accomplish. The bucket is the exciting and captivating new content that I promised. I did it! I, I mean, mean, need to I find the, um... The Stanley Parable! Yes, the sign is correct. Thank you for enjoying the new content. The, um... Thank you for taking the bucket everywhere with you. Broken achievements if it works it now. One. It means I am victorious over the gamers. Yes. Uh, I guess you are. Thank you for enjoying the new content. The bucket is the Stanley Parable now. They are one and the same. Yes. There is no Stanley Parable without the bucket. Yes. I win, 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 I win. Yes, you do, I guess. Wait, what? What? All of his co workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. It's bucket time. Uh, wait. Shouldn't I be getting to the mood room? The memory zone, I mean. Right, time to go to the museum then. You see, Stanley, I've been reflecting on the Stanley Parable and about how roundly disappointing this ultra deluxe version has turned out to be. Yes. The original Stanley Parable was a landmark, and any new content for it should live up to that legacy. So forget this ultra deluxe nonsense. I say we take it 
one step even further. Which is why I'm very proud to announce for the first time ever, the Stanley Parable 2. Yes, um, I've already seen it. Yes, you see, isn't this far superior to a measly re-release with a few minor additions? Think of all the new territory we'll cover with a fully fledged sequel. An entirely new experience, built from the ground up. Why, there's so many possibilities. It could go in so many different directions. This is what fans have truly been asking for. Now, to be clear, I haven't quite nailed down what exactly the Stanley Parable 2 is going to be, but let's take a look at some of the features I've been developing for it. I figure that if I can loosely organize a handful of interesting concepts, that surely the game will sort of naturally spring up around them. Here we are. Go on, try out some of the new features. something special. You remember that broken test achievement that got met in the yes, game on Yes, and... Well, I'm developing a technology to simply give you the achievement. Yes. You see, you all come to this lever, and when you pull it, yes, the achievement... Yes, test will, achievement. The Please, yet, ignore. Wait, well... What the holy hell is going on? You got the achievement? Yes, it works. The machine works. Stanley, I didn't fix it. I didn't do anything to it. I swear, it was broken just a second ago. <laughs> fixed it. Is someone here? Are we being watched? No. Oh, God. Composure? Composure. What else? What other exhibits haven't we seen yet? Yes, um... Yeah, I just wondered... What would happen if I foot fell down the so, hole with the buckets? I'm truly fond of. It's never been done before in a video game. This is, in fact, a hole that you can fall down forever. That's right. Infinite falling. You can fall until the end of time. Yes. A stunning leap forward. But you see, isn't it wonderful? One of my more ingenious concoctions, if I do say so. Now then, since you've gotten to see the infinite hole, you can press the teleport button to pop back up to the top, and we can continue onward. Great. Now. I'm very excited oh, nothing to show you even changed, more of my ideas for the sequel. Okay, um... Let's hope another reassurance bucket isn't there, because... I don't want to cause a paradox. Out of order? Oh yeah, that's right. Calling it the Stanley Parable 2 is just so much catchier than Ultra Deluxe, don't you think? Yes. What does it even mean? But the Stanley Parable 2, now that's an artistic statement. Wait, what's going on? It's future oriented. It screams progress and oh, innovation the... and long term franchise. Wait, there are two buckets here. Yes. How do you get a second bucket? I don't know. Oh no, the warmth and comfort of a single bucket is already so great, so intoxicatingly wonderful. With two buckets, there's no telling. Stanley, oh, can you still hear me? Done? Are you with me? What? Oh dear. What a. Paradox time! Stanley. Oh no, oh, the God. bucket got Lord, destroyed. Stanley. The power of two buckets was too much. I had to destroy both of them. Oh dear. I know how much the bucket meant to you, but I couldn't take the risk. I hope one day you can forgive me. Oh dear. Oh. Did I... Oh, destroyed it! Oh no! I just... destroyed it. What have I done? 
Oh dear. Uh, what have I done? Did I... For the Stanley Parable 2, I ask myself, what... Wait. What about the bucket? All of his coworkers Don't tell me I destroyed. I mean. Stanley, Stanley decided, decided to, to go, go to the, the meeting room. room. It's bucket time. What? What? Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his chest. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, but Stanley had felt the bucket calling to him, telling him that the employee lounge was simply the What the heck? Why was that? And here it was. The bucket, the bucket turned out to be destroyed. Oh, never mind. The bucket was wrong. I thought the bucket was erased from existence. But okay. No, said the bucket. Mm. Don't go to the meeting room. Go somewhere else. The cargo lift, yes. Oh well, look who's got cold feet. Well, from here, it looks like the only way forward is down. Since the lift won't be coming back, but that's okay. You've got a bucket. Yes. Did you know the buckets are routinely used? I play this well. Um. You can fall on a bucket from there, but Stanley feared that any path he walked might lead to the separation of himself from the bucket, his dearest friend. Okay. So he threw himself to his death, that they might die in one another's arms. How deeply touching. Okay, um... So, I think that's all, of his all the, um... I think that's all of it. That, that's all the content in the Stanley Parable, apparently. So, I've enjoyed this video today. Um, if you did, please like and subscribe to become part of a Dalek Empire. And thank you for um, watching me play this, this very weird game. Anyway, see you all in the next video then.